are we costume jewelry as believers in Christ? Okay, this is costume jewelry. And what costume jewelry is, is basically it looks beautiful and it's inherently not really worth much, right? It's just gold spray paint over plastic, all right, or whatever it is. But it's costume jewelry. These are not real pearls. This is not real gold. And you know, one way you'll know if it's real or not is melt it. Put a flame of trial and you'll find out if it's real. The testing of our faith shows the reality of our faith, doesn't it? Are we costume jewelry, which is on the outside beautiful, but on the inside worthless, okay? Now, many people think of their Christianity as like that. On the outside, I do what's right. I go to church. I give some money. I try not to use those words. I try not to act like that. I try not to get too much over here, not too much. And we say things like this, you know, everything in moderation and everything in balance. And so I just want to kind of be in the middle here. And I want to just stay pretty on the outside. But on the inside, I'm like, I really feel like I remember a few weeks ago, I'm that toothbrush that displeases God. And God's always frowning at me and he doesn't love me. And so I'm costume jewelry. Are we costume jewelry or are we tarnished silver? Tarnished silver on the outside doesn't look real pretty, but it is worthwhile. This is valuable silver. This is real on the inside, but on the outside, it's tarnished. And what happens is we go to Bible study, we go to church, we worship, we share our faith, we give through kainos and other things, and we are basically rubbing off with silver polish as we, as, we, as we do those things to then bring out what's really there. So the tarnished silver is inherently valuable. The costume jewelry is inherently not valuable. This one looks pretty on the outside. This one does not look pretty on the outside. But what sanctification does is it changes tarnished silver and it makes it beautiful. And now through the sanctification that we have of Bible study, of prayer, of walking with God, it takes who we really are and brings it out. So now we reflect Jesus. We shine with Christ. So let me tell you, believer, and this was this, I I hope it is for you. It was for me. This was life-changing for me. I always thought deep in my heart, I really still wanted to sin. That's what I really want to do. And I had to push all that back to be a good Christian. When really I have to release what I really want to do is walk with God. And so now my life is a life of surrender, not a life of effort. Hey, thanks for watching. To find out more about Houston's First, you can subscribe to our channel or you can go to houstonsfirst.org.